James, you've had time to reflect on the game against England now. Um, where do you feel that one went wrong? Uh, I think it starts with our front five. Um, we looked at our work rate and our uh, through our stats and and uh, front five for me in, in the game that was quite attritional, didn't make enough tackles. Um, and we conceded two real soft tries uh, through first phase or you know plays off 10, um, which is something that we like to eradicate going into South Africa. Do you take a lot of confidence from that first half performance? Yeah, I think we were excellent first half, um, particularly with ball in hand and we kicked well as well to uh, gain territory. I thought that was excellent. Um, and we, we forced England into errors, which kind of put them off their game. Um, so please him, but second half then we uh, couldn't gain the territory that we had in the first half and, and that cost us. South Africa next. How is that game going to differ from this one against England? Uh, I think it'll be as physical, if not more physical. I think South Africa, um, obviously a big side. Um, they've got a very good kick in 10, so that'll bring a different challenge defensively for us. Um, looking at our backfield a bit more, working a bit harder. But with that, I think um, our, it plays into our strengths as well with our running rugby that we like to promote. So I think I think it's a real opportunity for us. And a home game for them, of course. So uh, perhaps a, a better atmosphere. Yeah, I think there'll be a few more people watching and uh, you know it's a prime game for us and it's a great opportunity for these boys to play South Africa in South Africa and uh, you know there's nothing bigger and it's an experience that they all hopefully won't forget.